Hello, this is Pete McCallan here and we are going to be looking at my song Enemies written and recorded on the album I Hear Your Voice. Um, so this is a very, very simple song to play from a chord point of view. Um, so I'm going to play a section of it first and then explain how to do it. So here we go. In you, Lord, I find my strength A righteousness fixed on my chest The bout of truth surrounds my waist And tears down lies against my name In your power I guard my mind Take captive thoughts the strong man by Salvation's helmet firm, secure Alert, empowered, unshakable Whoa ground filled with the spirit of god whoa my enemies surround but i stand my ground filled with the spirit of god So on, so it then continues on to um, verse three and verse four. So we start off this song, um, capo four, for those who are playing acoustic guitar. And um, the, the three chords that we use pretty much throughout the song in capo four are the E minor, the G, and the C. But often I take play the C without that final finger on on the B string first fret, so keep it more open. Um, and the start of the song just starts with those hits. I think the hardest part of the song is probably actually the rhythm. The chords are very easy. Um, so you're counting one, two, three, four. Hit two, three, one, two, three, four. Two, three, one, two, three, two, three. That final hit. That, that's the rhythm of the song. Um, very important because if you can't play that, you'll struggle to play the whole song. So it's worth getting a click metronome in place and practicing at home to the click and just getting those hits absolutely right. Um, and then then you, you go to finger picking. Um, I have a really unusual finger picking habit where I use my thumb and first finger a lot with this song. Um, and you're literally going E minor to the G tend not to put any fing other fingers on and here I'm just all the only finger I'm holding on is the third fret on the A string with the second finger so E minor to the G and just the root note of the C and you're doing that all the way through the verses um, then you get to the chorus and you literally just Bring it out on the thumb. All my enemies surround. Maybe pull out, pull the strings there. But I stand my ground. Still the same chords, and so on. My enemies surround. But I stand my, and I hide my, my, my pick in my hand like this, and just pull it through, and and play that open C2 chord. Filled with the spirit of God. At this point, we then come in with a light kind of strum. Three, four. Two, three, four. And then you carry on playing the song with the pick in your hand. 
same chords. You get to the chorus, and this time you, um, my enemies around, but I stand my ground, filled with the Spirit of God. So what you're doing here is you're just strumming that part instead of kind of picking it with your fingers. Um, then after that, we get to the kind of the instrumental section. Um, with the woes, the vocal woes over the top of it. Whoa, whoa, whoa. And what I tend to do when I'm playing the acoustic here, I really try and listen to the drums on the track and follow what they're doing. So there's a few more hits at this point because it's a bigger part of the song. So you kind of go, maybe give me some space. Add those extra two hits in there. And so on. Just to give that energy. And then as we build into the final chorus, you really want to be able to just build with that um, strumming. So you kind of go... Or you could go, and then you're into the final chorus, which really hits home. And this is where the strumming pattern changes, and you, you kind of go to this, um, at, all the way through this song, you're kind of hitting down strokes a lot of the time. Bam, 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 bam. But this time you use the up stroke on your strumming hand as well. So you're going. I am the miss around. And you also find that you use your, your third and your fourth finger um, on on your E and your B string um, at the top of the guitar. But I stand by now, filled with the Spirit of God. Oh, my enemies surround, but I stand by crown, filled with the Spirit. And the final part of the song is very, very simple. You literally just ring out that E minor. All my enemies surround G, but I stand my ground. And just that C2 shape. So three chords throughout the whole song, um, but it's all about the rhythm and what you're doing with your fingers and, and following the drum parts really carefully so that you build that kind of light and shade in the dynamics. And this song is is based on a Bible verse in Ephesians five, Ephesians six, which talks about um, standing our ground and and not being intimidated by the enemy's schemes or strategies. And so um, this was written out of a heart to say to people who are Christians, "Come on, stand your ground, be strong, don't don't step back." And we all have things that come against us in life, um, but to stand strong filled with the Spirit of God is the best thing we can do. So I hope you enjoy the song. I hope you enjoy playing it. And um, we'll see you soon. <laughs>